damn, I need a haircut. Looks like I broke that piece of shit Joby again. Tried to heat it up with the soldering iron, kind of weld it back together, but that didn't work. I'm going to switch over to photos so that you guys don't get seasick from all the shaky cam. This is what I started with. It's the Joby Griptite Gorilla Pod Smartphone Tripod Stand. Now, I don't think the one that I bought was the extra large, but you get the idea. Now, I really like the actual iPhone holder, the part that gripped the phone. It worked pretty good, you know, right up until it broke. But it's just way too much force for that connection where the plastic is just kind of molded around that metal nut. The rest of it's in great shape though. The base is pretty good. I do see a couple hairline cracks in the balls, but you know, I guess that just happens. It's been really handy to shoot videos, to wrap it around a tree or a post or something in weird angles. It's been pretty handy. You know, I think they just make this stuff for a bunch of Metro hipsters so they can slide it into their courier bag. They don't really make it for real men. So what I decided to make is a steel one. So I got some, I think there's about a sixteenth of an inch steel here. I'm going to bend it up. The plan is I'm going to use a spring to put tension on a little V that will hold the phone in place. So I had to dump out all my springs to find one that looks good. I just picked these up at Home Depot. I feel like Goldilocks trying to find the right one. All right, well, the T-Nut's the gift that keeps on giving. And here's a shot of the mechanism that's going to keep the phone sandwiched into the holder. I'm using a quarter-inch bolt. I just had this grade 8 laying around. And a quarter-inch T-Nut. And I ended up grinding off those tips of the T-Nut so that I wouldn't snag my finger on them. And also, I'm going to end up cutting the excess threads off of that bolt. Now, the nut you see on it is actually a 5 16 nut, and that way the shoulder of the quarter inch bolt can slide up and down inside it. It's going to act like a collar. The nut will be welded to the top of the phone holder. I drilled the hole a little oversized so that that way the quarter inch bolt can slide through it pretty easily without a lot of restriction. I think I ended up drilling it with like a 5 16 bit. Here's a shot of the bottom. You can see the quarter inch nut that I just basically tack welded to the bottom of the uh, sheet metal there. And I was kind of concerned I wouldn't have enough surface area to make it sit flat, but the quarter inch nut provides enough. It worked out pretty well. I laid it on its side so you can get an idea of what the curves look like that kind of grip around it. I just have a slight bend at the bottom to uh, support the phone and then the T-nut with that spring does the uh, compression on the top. And here's the finished product. I gotta say it was a pretty fun little project. I, I thought I was just wasting my time when I was doing it but in the end it's really useful. It's really heavy duty. Works great. It's easy to slide the phone in. You know, it took me all of probably an hour to make this thing, and I think it's going to last as long as I'll be shooting with an iPhone. Thanks for watching.